If you see anything good that is going on in the city of Boston, especially when it has to do with young people and children, you will see Josh or Anita or both of them behind that organization. I think what makes Anita and Josh stand out as philanthropists is that they don't just write checks. They get personally incredibly committed to the goals and the mission of the organizations that they support. Some of the places where Anita and Josh have put the most effort in, like Year Up and City Year and Upstream and Big Brothers Big Sisters, are places that are really about changing the trajectory of kids' lives. I've had the good blessing to be a big brother now for almost 30 years. Uh, it influenced my life greatly. I would not be here today if it wasn't for Big Brothers, and I know folks like Josh and Anita have been supporting that cause resolutely for many years, and I tell you, our community is better off as a result. I mean, I think in terms of the, the words that describe my parents, I think they're very kind and generous. I think they, they're kind of always thinking about other people, whether it's family or their colleagues or friends or just the community in general. I'm really impressed with Anita and Josh's philanthropy, in part because they really bet on people. They don't just bet on ideas, but they bet on real people and they get to know and they invest in the relationships. They also, they make big bets. They really see something that has like the inklings of a potential and they say, we're gonna be there for you. And that is incredibly valuable to those of us who work in the nonprofit sector. One thing that Josh and Anita do when they're involved in an organization, they get you involved. I love that, I love that about them. You learn something, you come away wanting to make change in your own life. If they're involved, it's kind of a, a good housekeeping seal of approval that you're an organization that merits being looked at and potentially supporting. Working with Josh is wonderful, and I think I can speak for most people who work with Josh, it's also tiring. He's incredibly energetic uh, and uh, incredibly uh, focused on uh, getting to uh, our goals. He's so passionate about uh, our achieving our mission and helping us to find the means to do that, um, that uh, it's, it's the best way of getting tired that I can think of. Anita has really influenced the depth to which I pay attention to the details. You know, she really like upped my game on let's really be serious about looking deep into, into the work. I really, really believe that what is uh, driving them is they're also looking at outcomes. And so it's not just the emotional interest in an issue area, it's they're investing in organizations that they truly believe can have the impact and can show outcomes. Josh and Anita's legacy will be a Boston that is different today than it was before they started. They will leave this community better off than when they found it. That has to be the richest legacy that anyone could wish for their lives. There's, you know, a handful of people in Boston who have been true leaders and have been incredibly generous, not just with their money, but with their time and their thought and their commitment to making Boston a better place and to making the children who live here have every possible opportunity that they can. And I can't think of anybody who does that really more than Anita and Josh. Congratulations, Anita and Josh, on receiving the James J. Pallotta Award. No one is more deserving than the two of you. And thank you from the bottom of my heart for your belief, not just in me, but in so many other leaders and organizations in our community, and your deep commitment and love for making Boston the best possible community it can be to help all of our children in need. Josh and Anita, congratulations. What a great honor, so deserving. Two of my favorite people. Thank you so much, everything you do. I can speak for children at risk and I can speak for uh, everyone who is suffering from cancer, or someday hopefully will not have to worry about cancer, uh, that you've had an enormous positive impact with your generosity, uh, with your time and effort, uh, and just by being super people to work with. So congratulations. Mom and Dad, we are very proud of you. You have taught us so many things, and we are better people for it. We are lucky to have learned so many things from you, and we hope to grow up to be like you. Congratulations on the award.